Are you there? I can't see you. Hi guys, gals, non-binary pals, welcome back to my channel. So, um, if I were a typical YouTuber, I'd be doing... <coughs> I'd be dying. <coughs> oh god. If I were a typical YouTuber, I would be doing Vlogmas, but I don't have the patience, the time, or the attention span to make a video every single day. Do you see this? This is a problem. Okay, so, I am a lazy person. I hate going to the hair salon, A, because it costs money, B, because I have kids and I have to find somebody to watch them, and C, because, well, people are touching my face. I do occasionally go. When I drive two and a half hours to a different town away from me, I will go to the school and I will let the newbie kids trim my bangs because bangs are fucking hard to conquer and I don't care if they fuck them up because they grow it's hair and I just excuse you so today's video what is it I haven't even gone that far I've just been rambling on about excuse me don't stop on my computer what yeah I'm talking to you I'm gonna trim my own bangs while showing you my favorite things of the month uh, my sister does this over on her channel this is her channel. I will also post a link down below. And I figured because like I've been actually getting into things that um, I would share with you my stuff because I'm not as fancy. And I'm gonna do this while cutting my own bangs. Oh, and excuse this mess and this mess. My face itched and I got a little carried away. <laughs> I'm a mess. So, away we go. By the way, this is my uh, dollar store fine comb that I got for my first favorite thing of the month that I use like all the time. Not only on me, but on my girls. Apparently I'm turning into an R&B star. Anyways, um, yeah, you got like a pack of like 12 combs and my boys stole some to do their little whoopee thing. I don't know what the hell they're doing with their hair. First thing, this, okay? It's like you put it in your hair when it's wet. It is a uh, lightweight conditioning for smooth, manageable hair. Detangler spray, but it's not like the you spray in and then you brush out your hair when your hair's dry. You put it in your hair when it's wet, like just the ends, right? You focus like mid-length to the ends and then you can either comb through. I don't always comb it through because my hair is like the worst to comb through or brush through when it's wet. Like it's just awful. But I'll put it through and I'll kind of like play with it with my hair and put my fingers through it. I do it with my girls and I kid you not, my hair, like granted there's still nuts. I'm not saying this is like a cure all whatever, but my hair is like so much easier to brush through. It's a bit of a godsend. Tizzers. Let's Let's chop away. Why don't we? You know, I've always kind of wanted to figure out how to make my bangs do this. Obviously, I'd have more bangs and like bangs coming down, but like in here to look like Mavis off of um, Hotel Transylvania. But then I feel like I'd have to dye my hair black again, and I'm not ready to make that commitment again. It's been. Oh, God, it's been like. Huh, like 15 years since I've made that commitment. Ugh. By the way, I am not a professional, so this is going to look like shit. Do not said Brand Mondo after me. And I always have to remember, remind myself, that when I pull my hair tight, it will bone go back up. So I cannot be like cutting too short. But like I need it on my eyebrows so that when I do my makeup, you can see my makeup. I can see my makeup. I don't care if you see it. Oh, Lord have mercy. Oh, oh my god, is it my <laughs> Okay. Now that I've cut a suction on my bangs, suction, a section on my bangs, we'll move on to product number two. It is this. And you see how much has gone out of it? Like, I know on this side it's like, oh, look how full, and on this side it's like, no, it's really not. I love this stuff. Um, I got it in a Fit Fab Fun Box, and I use it as a moisturizer because it is freaking amazing. But depending on where you buy it, it is anywhere from $30 to $42 for this size, okay? Okay? So I will not be repurchasing this. I did buy a new one since I'm running low on this one to try, um, and I'm really hoping that it works because, oh my gosh, I shopped Elf on Black Friday. 50% off. 
for the whole store. 30% off some things plus 50% uh, Like, I got a killer deal on all my shit. I mean, Elf's a good deal anyways. Next section. Give it to me, baby. Uh, 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 uh. That. Gone. Dunzo. Ciao. I don't know why, but I always feel the need to make my bangs longer at my nose. Like, dyed my unibrow. It's just how I cut it. It always. Like, no fill. Okay. Next section done. Don't worry. It's not going to stay like this. Okay? Okay. So, my next favorite problem. I, if my nails aren't done fake, which I only splurge on that every once in a while, I love black nails. I've actually, like, finished bottles of black nail polish. No other nail polish I've ever finished. It normally goes bad. But I've finished black bottles of nail polish. I've only had this for, like, five months. It is wet and wild. It is black nail polish. The only fault to this nail polish and it's probably why it's at the dollar store. Oh, well now it's gonna work. Is that the little wand thing, half the time I twist off the lid and the lid comes off but the little wand thing's still stuck in there and you have to put the lid back on, twist it, and, like squeeze and then like, I'd probably say squeeze because I'm so used to squeezing it. Yeah, um, this is single, oh, focus on my nails, dude. Come on, not my face. Are you focusing? I can't even see. Uh, single coat, is that focusing? I don't think it's focusing. Whoa! Oh, there we go. Uh, but I love this shit because it's like super cheap and I literally like run through it. So like a dollar from the dollar store. Who can beat that? Who had you another section? This one really looks like I partially cut it. What? What is happening there? It's just like I did not cut over here yet. What? I don't know. Oh crap, scissors. Bangs in my eyeballs do not feel good. Ah. Gone. I cut it at an upward angle. Okay. Straight. Oh, that was better. Okay. Okay, so my next favorite thing, you might think it's going to be from the most recent Manga Lost. It's not. It's this. I don't like non-liquid lipsticks. I love this stuff. I love how it feels. I love the colors. I love the nudes. I'm not a nude person. I love the nudes. My kids love it. It's a problem. They try to steal it. Last section. Okay. What is happening to my face right now? You are Sam. You're happening to your face right now. Oh. Uh, pff, I don't know. Okay. I'm gonna let that dry and see what happens. My next product is these boppers. Okay, so I bought the Ulta brand ones. Don't do that. They like dissolve and fall apart and they're not very good and they're super fluffy. And so I went and got these ones, okay? You can get them at Walmart and get them at Target and they're like the Walmart or Target brand. This side, they're thinner, they're not so fluffy, so you get more. This side is like soft and everything, and this side is exfoliating, exfoliating. And so it really like because I wash my face and then I tone my face, and I tell you what, washing your face is not cutting either that or I don't know how to wash my face, and I'm doing a really shitty job at it. I think I'm gonna leave my bangs just like that. They don't look too bad, do they? I mean, give me your honest opinion, because quite honestly. I know I look like a potato, so I don't really give a shit if you think I do, because you ain't told me something I don't already know. My last thing, I got this in a Ipsy bag, and it is the Ico Black Magic Liquid Liner, okay? I have a liquid liner, I couldn't tell you what brand it was, but it's like a, like, a soft brush, like the brush really like, like you're writing calligraphy. This one is like a paint pen, okay? Ugh. It doesn't screw us right. So, like, yeah, it's got some fluidity to it, but it's also, like, hard and stiff. And, obviously, drawing on me. I couldn't have licked a different finger. No, I had to lick the makeup. Seriously, Sam. Mm. All over. When it starts to, like, not have stuff in the brush, you have to put the lid back on so that it pushes the mechanism in to put more, like, eyeliner stuff in there. But it works so good on cat eyes, especially if you're really shitty at cat Like, I still have to erase my cat eyes, like, three times to make them look even remotely similar. I don't know if it's my eyes or what, but, like, this one always turns out perfect. And this one always turns out, like, either up here or up here, looking like some crazy-ass shit. They're, like, second cousins three times removed. They gotta at least be sisters. Come on. I will be buying more of this, more of this eyeliner. Anyways, um, that's the end of this video. My bangs don't look all too bad. Thanks for watching, and... We'll see y'all next time.